short from Animals at Home Podcast. And like and subscribe if you have not been to Animals on Podcast. It's pretty pretty cool pretty cool uh, channel there. But uh, listen to him. He he knows what he's saying. We gotta ban Lou Woods, man. Gotta ban him. I got that bitch on video. So that is Jeff Leibowitz, and the thing he has on video is him taking a bite from an inland taipan, which is the most toxic snake on the planet. Now, fortunately for him, it was a baby, and that's probably the only reason he's alive, not to mention, of course, all the anti-venom he would have been administered at the hospital. Now, if you go back to the beginning of the video, you can actually see some Sharpie on his index finger that is very likely where he took the bite. Again, he's very fortunate to be alive, but the point is, this is a very controversial figure in the reptile world. He has a lot of history of being abusive to people. I guess as far as I'm concerned, those are more allegations, but they seem like credible allegations. But he's promoting a practice of free handling venomous, venomous snakes online through social media platforms like YouTube and Instagram, and he paid the price. And now it sort of seems like he's back and he's gonna kind of continue that practice and eventually either hurt himself, deprive anti-venom from the rest of the world or from the rest of North America if he gets bit again, and also just promote a bad practice. So what are your thoughts? Hey, Nelson, happy air guard, You know what my thoughts are? We should ban this man ban, 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 and do everything. Any creator out there, if you have the ability, Wiccans, Wicked Reptiles, Clint, everybody, everybody, let's ban this man. Let's get him off the internet before he gets somebody really hurt that just doesn't know any better and think he's doing something right. This, this should just stop.